Hi, and welcome to the Estes Park News Weekend Report for the first weekend in winter. I'm Chris Hazelton. The holiday season is a great time to visit Rocky Mountain National Park. In addition to beautiful scenery, wildlife viewing, and a variety of winter activities to do on your own, some fun activities with park rangers are offered. Rocky Mountain National Park has a calendar full of family fun activities for the holidays such as reading with a ranger, snowshoe ecology walks, cross-country ski excursions, and the Spirit of the Mountains movie. For more information, call the park's information office at 586-1206. All park visitor centers and the information office, though, will be closed on December 25th. The town of Estes Park has installed an outdoor ice rink downtown again this winter. The rink is located in the public parking lot on the southeast corner of Elkhorn and Riverside Drive. The fee for ice skating is $2 and skate rentals are $2. Normal operating hours are Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays, but for the Christmas holiday, December 21st through January 4th, the rink will be open daily, 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. Christmas Eve hours will be 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. and the rink will be closed on Christmas Day. On Wednesday, Mayor Bill Pinkham, town dignitaries, business owners, and employees gathered together for a special ribbon-cutting ceremony which marked the celebration of reopened businesses on the east side of Elkhorn Avenue. The event was a kickoff for the East End Block Party being held this weekend. Participating shops and restaurants will have hot cider, cookies, and other celebrations to thank those who have shopped at their establishments and to welcome those coming to town to do some last minute shopping for gifts or gift certificates. Also this weekend will be the very special Luminary Holiday Shopathon in downtown Estes Park. This weekend, downtown shops will stay open late to welcome you to find one-of-a-kind gifts under the twinkling white lights adorning the trees with bright winter luminaries lighting your path. Estes Park lodging, restaurants, and spas are offering special getaway packages and more. For the kids, make sure to stop by the old church shops both Saturday and Sunday from 12 to 4 p.m. to meet Santa Claus and let him know your last-minute Christmas wishes. Don't forget, shop local and support Estes Park. This week we leave you with some adorable photos of the 57th annual Tiny Tots with Santa which was held last Saturday at the American Legion Hall. 160 kids full of giggles and grins sat on Santa or Mrs. Claus's lap and told them what they'd like for Christmas. Most were excited to see old Saint Nick, but a few were a bit skeptical about the bearded Santa Claus. All of the photos taken of the kids are in this week's edition of the Estes Park News, and parents can download their child's photo on our website at estesparknews.com. That's all for this week. I'm Chris Hazelton, and all of us here at the Estes Park News want to wish you and yours a very Merry Christmas. Thank you.